YouTube. What's good, guys? It's your boy T, and I'm back again with another video from Fantasy Good Sports, guys. And today's videos are going to be on three rookie sleepers, guys. Yes, three rookie sleepers that you should be stashing in your drafts. Now, listen, if you're in redraft or dynasty, you need to be going after these guys. If you're in dynasty, these guys, you should be buying low on. And listen, a lot of these guys is not really, you can't really buy that low on because they are starting to trend. But in, but in redraft, you can get these guys, and they some of these guys won't even be drafted. But I got three guys today, guys. So make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. This is cutting edge content. I said what I said. This is cutting edge content. So let's begin with no further ado. The first guy, guys, that I believe that you should be stashing, and he's going undrafted in some drafts, but he's starting to trend up, is Deuce Fong from the Dallas Cowboys. I said what I said. Deuce Fong. Now, listen, guys. I believe the reason why Dallas had, didn't go pick up Zeke or Kareem Hunt or some of these other veteran running backs it was, is because they believe in Deuce Fong. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Yes, guys, they believe in Deuce Fong. Now, listen, I believe that Tony Pollard and Deuce Vaughn is going to be a top threat, like top duo in the league. Uh-oh! I said what I said. These guys are going to be top uh, duos. Now, listen, you might say, well, Deuce Vaughn is too little. Listen, this guy's the next Darren Sproles. He might be better than Darren Sproles. I said what I said. Now, listen, I, was, I wasn't I was on him early. You know, usually I'm on all the cutting-edge guys. He slipped through. But now I finally realize, and I've been watching him, watching him camp. Guys, he, he got the sauce. He not just going to be on no pump return, kick, pump return, kick return. He not, no, he's just not doing that. He's going to be getting carries. So, Tony Pollard's going to be the bell cow. And Deuce Vaughn's going to be coming in spelling him like a Darren Sproles row. I said what I said. Deuce Vaughn going to shock a lot of people, especially in redraft. In Dynasty, his value is going up. People are drafting him now in a four-round draft, like in the third round, in a five-round draft, maybe the fourth round, right? They got, he's trending up. But in redraft, ain't nobody touching him. So you can have this guy stash him, and you got a flex play. I think you're going to have a flex play. I said what I said. This team is going to be going through Tony Pollard, and Deuce Vaughn is going to be coming in because Tony Pollard can't get a bunch of carries. He can't get a bunch of carries. You see what happened last year at the end, but he just they're not going to get him the ball 20 times a game, about 15 times a game, and Deuce Vaughn going to get the rest. I said what I said. Uh-oh. All right, guys, moving on to my next guy, my next rookie. This guy's a wide receiver. He's from the Arizona Cardinals, and it's Michael Wilson. This guy's Michael Wilson. Now, listen, Michael Wilson, guys, he's not the fastest. He's not the quickest, but this guy is a professional wide receiver, right? He's a professional. He can do it all. He can run really good routes. He's good at in and out of his breaks. He's strong. He's solid. He's just sneaky. A lot of people looking for somebody that runs four threes and four fours. Just got on. He's not that. Now he's not slow, but he's not like a, what you call a phenom type athlete. But he's still really, really good. He's savvy. He went to a really good uh, school, uh, college school, and they taught him how to run routes. Right? I, th he, I think I believe he went to Stanford, and Stanford they coach their players up really, really well. So I love Michael Wilson, guys. I think this guy is going to be strong. I think he's the number one wide receiver on Arizona. Uh oh. I said what I said. The reason why I believe that he is the number one wide receiver because Marquise Brown can't take a workload. He's he's too volatile. He's too injury prone. Rondell Moore is a, is a is a gadget guy. The best route runner on his team already, guys, is going to be Michael Wilson, if you ask me. I said what I said. All right, guys, moving on to my third and final guy. And I've talked about this guy already, and I think this guy could be a top 24 wide receiver. And it's Jalen Hyatt from the New York Giants. Yes, guys, and listen, you know how I feel about Daniel Jones. That's my MVP candidate, and my bold prediction video is coming. Thanks for one of my members, uh, guys, to sign up for one of my memberships. Um, Lindale, he ref he asked me to do a video on bold predictions, and that video is coming. So appreciate you, Lindale. But listen, guys, Jalen Hyatt is a great speed demon got to help push the safeties back for the new york giants so Darren waller wandell robinson and isaiah hodgins and all these guys can work underneath so i love that Jalen hyatt is the speed guy and actually he was slept on in the rookie draft in the the regular nfl draft he was slept on this ah, he just a speed demon he only got speed he don't run no routes he just go deep and he because he had like five touchdowns against alabama ah that was just cause of speed and alabama wasn't in the right coverage no this guy can play he's a he's very very he's the most explosive wide receiver probably in this draft i said what i said so guys make sure you pick up Jalen Hyatt. i'm not gonna hold you up on this video guys make sure you pick up these three guys 
Also, guys, if you want to support the channel, make sure you sign up for one of the membership tiers. The least, at least the Pro Bowl tier. If you sign up for the Pro Bowl, Pro Bowl tier, guys, or better, you get in my videos before anybody else. When I upload it, it goes to the membership people first for about an hour. You get to watch it, digest it, and you're going to be getting some personal videos too, where it's just for you, right? Just for the guys that are signed up for certain membership tiers. So, guys, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. This is Cutting Edge Content. Peace!